Back in August, a brand new food truck started hitting the roads here in Harrison County, serving up some mountain made minis. Harley Benda caught up with the Drifter Donuts truck for this week's restaurant road trip. We started out um, about mid August and we've been operating since. Drifter Donuts started out less than two months ago selling their mountain made minis. In that time, they've accumulated just over 2,000 likes on Facebook and nearly 500 followers on Instagram. The idea of a mini donut truck has been something the Chalmers family has wanted to do for a while. We've been wanting to do this for a few years now. Um, our kids were too young at the time when we came up with the idea for a donut truck. And we just wanted some really good quality donuts to be in the area. So we decided to just start making them ourselves. The donuts all start the same, but the toppings are what brings each order apart. I'd say one of the top favorites is definitely maple bacon and apple crisp. Um, those are our top two favorites. People really like the candy bar toppings as well. We just keep adding flavors like every week, so I don't know if we'll ever stop. Since so many people like the donuts, Chalmers says her and her husband have talked about the idea of opening a storefront location. Eventually, we've talked about what it would be like if we had a brick and mortar store. Right now, we do love the flexibility of being able to work on the weekends and see our kids a lot during the week. My husband still works full time, Corey, so. Um, right now, this is good for us, and we'll see what the future holds. And of course, none of this will be possible for Chalmers without community support. People have just been so responsive to it and so welcoming to us, um, and we love to be able to do it here in our home county. Now, Drifter Donuts has so many different varieties of donuts that you can choose from when you come to visit. What they've given me here is a half a dozen of s'mores. I cannot tell you just how good these smell, so I'm going to dig into these. For now, reporting in Bridgeport for this week's restaurant road trip, I'm Harley Venda. Well, they must be good because I don't think she brought them back to the newsroom. <laughs> so that gives you a hint right there. Be sure to head over to Drifter Donuts Facebook page to see a full listing of where they will be and when. And we'll have a link to that, of course, and all of our past stops on the restaurant road trip at WBLY.com.